First Crop Yearling Sire, City of Light, has been the talk of the Keeneland sales ground this week after he produced a pair of million dollar colts, including the current $1.7 million sale topper. While high demand has made it challenging for buyers to get their hands on yearlings by this Lane's End Sire, there are plenty more City of Light progeny still to sell in the coming days. We took a look at some of his yearlings going through book three this weekend at Keeneland. The September sale results for City of Light so far have been astounding, um, nothing short of it really. Um, I think it's a testament to the type of physical that he throws, the quality that he puts into all of his foals. And the market is really reflective of the individuals that are out there. If you have a nice individual, whether it's in book one or book five, you're going to do well with it. Um, that, that sort of quality is what's sought out. You know, going into book three, I expect the same sort of trends with how well they've been received in the earlier books. I only see it, you know, continuing on in the second part of the sale. This is a lovely colt. We've always liked him. He's so well balanced and so athletic and he's a lovely walker. And um, knowing the mare the way we do, we've raised all her foals and when she gets a good one, you can tell from the beginning it's a, gonna be a good one. Selcourt was a superstar, and this was a really nice colt too, and she gets lots of runners, so we're thrilled to have him here. So we are sitting uh, 14.08 on Saturday, uh, a city of light filly from uh, Betty, out of Betty Draper. It's a lovely filly who, who stand over a lot of ground, and she's very athletic. And what we love the most is the way she moves. She's very fluid and efficient when she moves. She's got that, that side, that look that most of the City of Light has. So we are very pleased to be able to present her to, to the market. And obviously, you know, City of Light had a good day yesterday and today. And, uh, and uh, that really by herself, without the sigh of power, talks for herself. But uh, we're excited to present her to the sex. Well, the City of Light filly that we have on offer in book three is out of a Dixie Union mare called Dixie Victory. She's a perfect package uh, to look at. She, she moves well, she's got a great range of motion. Um, she's keen looking too, pretty head and eye. And she's the type that I think would suit any end user or a pin hooker, whether you're looking to go to the races or resell next year. We love all the City of Lights. We've not really, we had a really nice one last night that sold for us in book two, and he was really nice. But this filly, they seem to have, a, they, he's stamping their horses, and he seems like every one of them have a great walk, great attitude, good body, good shape. Well, I really like her attitude and everything. Um, she's real forward. Every time you bring her out to show her, she's always on and ready to go, just like she wants to do a job and go forward. Um, just stands up nicely, does her job, big walk, um, does everything perfectly for us at this point. Mm -hmm.